so to make a sugar rocket we need these two things at first i will take 40 gram of sugar and i will grind it to make a fine powder now i will take 60 g of potassium nitrate and we'll grind it it will increase the surface area and hence the rate of reaction will be increased at first i will mix only 50% of each powder because i will mix the other compound in the other 50% powder it will be in another video mix them properly so that it reacts evenly Let's test it with the small amount. It burns nicely, so now we can use in our rocket. I'm using a test tube to see the reaction going inside. I will press it down to make more dense and will create more thrust. In the end, I will fill a fine soil to block the cylinder. make a small hole to put the fuse in okay now i will put this fuse inside
finally it is ready to use I will stick it to this stone so that it don't move and we can observe the reaction going inside Well, it burned nicely, but the thrust wasn't enough to take it into the air. Now this time I will compress more to get more thrust and also I will use a wet clay so that it don't come off and provides better thrust I had keep it for a while to dry and now I will stick more test tubes so that it looks like a rocket. And after inserting the fuse, it's ready to get launched. It failed to take off because the test tube melted from the side. As you can see here, and the gas release from this side, that's why it's not able to take off. Now this time I am using a steel cylinder so that it don't get melt and hope it will work. I have repeated the same process but this time I compressed it more and also I will make a big hole so that the exhaust gas don't get blocked I will stick it to the long stick to stabilize the rocket in the air
and again it failed because most of the fuel don't burn well i came up with the another one with some improvements and finally it worked okay hope you like this video and sure to subscribe see you in the next video